make a much better use of time than the people of goodwill. And then he wrote, we are going to be made to repent in this generation, not for the vitriolic words and deeds of bad people, but for the appalling silence of good people. He was saying to us, the good people of this country, the good people of this community, can't just sit back and be quiet when things are not right. Silence gives consent. If something is going on and you don't say anything about it, it's because you consent. Even if you don't think you do, by your actions, you do. That's what has begun to happen to us. I, back in 2008, Lord have mercy, how we went out and voted. Barack Obama became president of the United States. And then when that was over, everybody said, I said OK, I've done mine. I elected him now. He going to go out and do it. We, you learned in eighth grade, or you should have, that we got three, three big parts of government. You got a group of people over here where I serve. 535 people sitting up there. Their job is to make the law. Barack Obama doesn't have one thing to do with making the laws. That's up to 535 people. And then you got nine guys. People now. Three women. They over there to interpret whatever law we pass. When we pass the Affordable Care Act, Barack Obama made one of it. He didn't vote for it. He doesn't have a vote in the Congress. We passed it. And I was the majority whip at the time. It was my job to count the votes, and I counted good. Then it was out of our hands. Then the nine people sitting over in the Supreme Court, they then took their turn. And then they decided that it was in fact constitutional. And that's when Barack Obama's job came to enforce it. So when you stop voting or finish your voting in 2008, you weren't finished. Not when there were Congress people to be elected in 2010. So I was sitting back so proud of having elected the first African-American president. And I, and I say that for America. Because his dad is African and mama American. <laughs> I like to be accurate. So I ain't dealing with all the trouble and stuff. I'm mean, African-American. We did it. And we seem to have forgotten that we still have work to do. And we still got work to do. Because the people of ill will in our society, some of them call themselves a Christian coalition, and ain't nothing Christian about them. 